In July 2011, I joined friends in Honduras on a mission to explore the health of the Mesoamerican Reef, which stretches nearly 700 miles in the Caribbean Sea, touching the coasts of Mexico, Belize, Guatemala, and Honduras. The primary target of our work was the Swan Island Marine Preserve. Our goals included to collect scientific data to document the condition of ecosystems in the reef, and then to provide policymakers with a better framework for conservation initiatives and the basis of a call to action. Our research work included linear transects of reef systems and other methods to determine species abundance and to assess trends versus historical data. On our last dive in Honduras, several of us experienced a stunningly close encounter with a group of large Caribbean reef sharks. I was diving with Dr. Sylvia Earle when several sharks approached to within several feet of us from different directions. While we didn't feel under attack, I felt compelled to use my camera housing to nudge them away from nearly point-blank encounters. As sharks reacted to these pokes from my camera, their swimming became agitated. This attracted more sharks and we sought shelter under a ledge from this growing frenzy. Other divers slowly moved away and up to the dive boat and we eventually followed. Days later, as we sought explanations for this alarming experience, we were told that the behavior of these sharks was likely the result of a lionfish control program in that location. Apparently, marine biologists had been feeding these sharks speared lionfish in an attempt to encourage shark predation on these unwanted invaders from the Indian Ocean. It's an experience I'll never forget. <laughs>